Hi everyone, uh, welcome to the another session of Jira administration. So today we are going to learn like how we can use Jira subscription to notify different members. Okay, what is Jira subscription? Jira subscription is used when you uh, write a particular filter uh, and uh, based upon that, the person who are subscribed to that particular filter would get a notification at a particular time. Okay, where we can use that. Okay, suppose in a project management, uh, when you are managing your project, you want to see during a sprint, what are the stories where there is no update happened in last couple of days, or how many issues are being logged today by the testing team. So these could be the scenario where you can use this subscription and let's see how we can use this subscription. Just click on the filters and then advanced issue search. And here you can write your filter. Suppose we are going to write a filter where there is no update happen from last couple of days. Okay, so we, we are just selecting the issues and their issue types or oh, project and their issue types. And I'm checking updated date within last three days. If there is no update happened within last three days. Okay, this is la uh, currently it's, this filter is uh, telling us like, show us the issue where is there any update happened in last three days, right? But we want issue where there is no update happened in last three days. For that, just switch to jQuery and just change this symbol, okay? And now you have all the issue where there is no update happening, okay? So just save this filter. No update last two days. Okay, just saving it, right? Okay, it's last three days actually. Okay, let's make it two days. So that would match with the filter name. And just again saving it. Okay, after this, just click on view all filters and you would get the filter over here. No update last two days. Just click on these three dots and uh, click on manage subscription. You just have to click on add subscription and set up a schedule, like who would be the uh, recipient of this particular email. So you can choose any group if uh, your management want to uh, get this notification at the end of the day, or if it's just a personal subscription, then let it be like, like in the current format, it is a personal subscription. Only you are going to get the email. Or you can choose a different kind of uh, group where you want to send this notification. Okay. So I want to send this notification every day, once in a day, at the end of the day, say 7 p.m. And this option would tell us like, just send this email if there is no issue found, even if there is no issue found. We just click on that and click the subscribe button. So it would show you filter over here. Okay, this this uh, this user is the subscriber. It is subscribed for this filter, and it is going to execute every time, every day, 7 p.m. We can also run it now and check it now. Like, is that working or not working? Just click on run now. Okay. Now I just have to open my emails and this is the user who configured uh, that uh, subscription. Okay, what was my filter name? No update last two days. Just click on that and you would get the subscription, uh, the filter value at your end. I hope you can use this feature during your uh, UI, during your testing days to check out how many issues are being reported in th at that particular day or during your sprint as well when you want like if any issue has not been picked by your team so i hope you enjoy that and you would use that thank you thank you everyone